Hi guys and welcome to my channel. Today's video I'm going to be doing my one month postpartum for you guys. Just a little update on how I'm doing and I'm going to update you guys on how Liam is doing as well because with one month postpartum means one month update for the little one. Um, he's currently sleeping right now so that is what he is doing. <laughs> Both of the babies are sleeping. <sighs> Thank goodness. <laughs> Um, but anyways, it has been a month on July 22nd. It has been a month of one month. Um, and basically for my labor and delivery, it went really easy and really smooth for the most part. And I just got really fortunate with that. And with that came a really pretty much easy recovery as well. I only had one tear, um, in labor, <laughs> delivering, I don't know, anyways, <laughs> I only had one tear, so they only had to stitch that up, um, so obviously I was a little sore the first couple of days and stuff like that, and I wasn't up and active as I normally was, but pretty quickly afterwards I was, you know, completely fine with walking and moving and getting in and out of bed and all that kind of stuff. So I had a pretty quick recovery. I bounced back pretty fast, but again, I did have a really easy labor and delivery, so I didn't have much to really hold me back from, you know, healing fast or faster than normal, I guess. Um, I healed a lot faster than I did with Jameson, or I felt at least a little bit better than I did with Jameson. Um, so there's been that. I have lost some weight. I haven't lost all of my weight. Again, I'm only one month um, postpartum, so I really shouldn't lose all of my weight. I am starting to get, like, my body back and look more back to normal. I will go show you guys, like, my belly um, and show you guys what it looks like. But I am starting to look a lot more normal and, like, my original self. I'm obviously going to have some working out to do. And my I'm also just going to have to wait for my skin to kind of tighten back up and do its thing. That just takes time. That's not going to happen overnight. Um... So, there's that. <laughs> um, I stopped bleeding around like three weeks. Mm, probably two weeks. Probably two and a half weeks. And then I've just been having spotting ever since. Every now and then, nothing crazy. Um, so, that's been really nice. Um, but, yeah, I've been feeling pretty freaking great. And I have no complaints about this labor, delivery, recovery, all of it. So I'm really excited and happy about that. That's pretty much it for myself. I'm feeling great. I'm feeling good. I am so ready for my um, six-week appointment, which is next Thursday. I'm having a, a couple of days before my actual six weeks, but that's because my doctor is so busy that, you know, it was the one that was able to work for me and her. So that is why I'm having it a couple of days early. Um, but she said it's only a couple days. It shouldn't matter. You know, you should be fine, especially since my delivery and all that stuff went really well. And I only had one tear. She's like, you know, you should be pretty much back to normal by then. So I should be pretty much good to go, which I'm so excited to get to back into working out. Obviously, I'm going to have to take it really slow and be really easy on myself for the first, you know, month or two. Um, which I'm totally okay with as long as I can get my butt in the gym and start walking and start doing stairs and start building some more muscle back up because I've definitely lost a lot of muscle. Um, I just, I'm ready to like get back to my normal self and be me. Um, and I feel like working out is one of those ways that's going to get me back into feeling like myself again. So once I start getting working out, I'm going to, I've already started trying to get back into an eating healthy, eating in a good eating habit, healthy eating habit, whatever I'm trying to say. <laughs> that is Liam. He is sleeping at the moment right here. So that's him making noises. Um, but I'm trying to get into a good healthy eating habit right now. I'm not doing perfect and I'm not, you know, cutting out everything. If I have slip ups, if I have my days, it's totally normal, especially, you know, I have two kids and. I'm still learning how to balance two kids, so it's going to take, a, you know, a process to get there, but I'm, I'm trying to start out now, that's why I kind of get ahead of the game, but if I'm, you know, 
I don't have to be hard on myself yet. But as for Liam, he is one month, obviously. Um, I post a picture on my Instagram. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, it'll be linked down below. It's always linked down below on my social, other social medias if you guys want to go check those out. As for Liam, he is doing absolutely great. He has definitely put on some weight, which is good. He's definitely getting a lot chunkier than what he has been. Um, he's still sleeping pretty much the same at night, but he's done pretty good for the most part in general. Last night he woke up twice. A couple of nights before that he woke up once. So, you know, he's on the two to one schedule. Hasn't woken up three times. The earliest he'll really wake up in the morning is like five is what I've experienced so far. And Jameson wakes up at five, so that's not really too bad for me because sometimes Jameson's already up. Um, so that I just consider as being up in the morning and I don't consider the middle of the night. So that's how that's working out for us. Um, but yeah, he's been sleeping pretty good. Only wakes up one to two times in the middle of the night, which is awesome for me. And, you know, he's eating good. He's gaining weight. He's been more awake throughout the day, which has been awesome too. He's just, you know, more alert and I try and keep him up more during the day. It's hard to keep a baby awake because sometimes they just fall asleep because there's not that many ways to entertain a newborn. So there's that. But I try and keep him awake as much as I can during the day. That way he does sleep a little bit better at night. Um, so he is just doing great and alive and thriving. Um, so yeah, I have nothing really to add to him. You know, he has really bad baby acne right now, but we're hoping that goes away soon. We haven't done anything to treat it or asked a doctor yet because it says, you know, up to three months they can have it. And I'm hoping within the next couple of weeks it'll subside. If not, I'll contact my doctor and kind of ask her, um, you know, what's going on. But yeah, he hasn't gotten a distinct eye color. They're mostly just gray. They're kind of leaning on the blue side, but I feel like some other days they kind of lean more brown. So we'll kind of see what eye color he has, but for now, I mean, they can change for up to a year, but um, for now, they're still just kind of gray. He doesn't have a distinctive eye color. Also has still pretty brown hair. The top looks like he's losing it. I don't know if they lose it or if they grow more hair on the sides. I don't know how that works, but he definitely has less hair on the top of his head than the sides. So he's looking a little old manish, but that's okay. <sighs> he's a chunky old man with baby acne. But yeah, that's pretty much it for our update. It's nothing too crazy, but I just wanted to kind of put it out there, get a little update. I'll show you guys my tummy. I don't mind the background because it's a mess in here. So just <laughs> bear with us for that part. But here's my tummy. This is it. So it's pretty flat. It's flattened out a lot, but I do still have like some extra skin hanging around. As we can tell, this is just like kind of extra skin and then my love handles I definitely gotta work on. But that's what the gym is for. We will get there. And then I'll show you Liam because apparently he's waking up right now, so. As you can't really tell on the camera, he looks really yellow right here and it kind of looks like he has jaundice, but he definitely does not. And definitely does not look yellow. <laughs> in person but he's just so cute and he's getting chubby chubby cheekers and he's just so he's getting pretty big in the tummy right here he's getting pretty big he's just so big okay I'll, i know i'll leave you alone he's probably gonna wake up to eat anyways so but that's pretty much it for um our one month postpartum and one month update um nothing too crazy it's only been a month so i just adjusting my body has really bounced back and i've been super grateful and i'm definitely still have a lot to work work to do to get to where i was before i was pregnant with him because i was in amazing shape <laughs> before him and i'm so sad <laughs> but I still have work to do and he has so much more growing to do within this first year. It's going to be absolutely crazy. I will keep you guys updated, you know, maybe on me if you guys are interested in that and how I do, what I do, my workouts and what I eat and all that kind of stuff to get to my body back. 
Um, if you guys are interested, let me know down in the comments below. Um, because I would love to film that for you guys if you guys are interested. If not, I won't waste your time. Also, if you guys want me to keep updating you guys on him, I can definitely do that as well and make those videos for you guys. Um, but yeah, that is it for my one month postpartum video. I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to blah, 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 blah. don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below so that you guys can always stay updated with us. I am getting better at posting or I will get better at posting. I've been a little off my game since Liam has been born, but I'm trying to get back to it. So vlogging doing any little updates for you guys any information that you guys want to know i've been thinking about doing my skincare routine soon or any favorites or any newborn items that you guys you know want suggestions on just let me know in the comments down below what kind of videos you guys want to see i can definitely make those videos for you guys so thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video bye hey, no, no, no.